priority control systems empower cities to manage how vehicles navigate their streets, so operations are safer, faster, and more efficient. There are two main types of priority control. Emergency Vehicle Preemption, or EVP, and Transit Signal Priority, or TSP. These systems request green lights to give priority to a variety of vehicles as needed. From fire trucks, police cars, and ambulances, to buses, streetcars, and snowplows. For public safety operations, signals are often preempted, or changed from red to green, when a request is made. With EVP, the light is held green until the vehicle has safely cleared the intersection. While it can be disruptive to normal traffic flow, it allows emergency vehicles to get to the scene quickly and safely. Public transportation vehicles, on the other hand, may request a green light, but that's only granted under certain conditions. Upon receiving a TSP request, the traffic controller will extend the green cycle or truncate the red cycle to give the priority vehicle an increased chance of clearing the intersection quickly. Rather than keeping the light green until the vehicle clears, TSP takes a small number of seconds from the side streets to allow the priority vehicle to get through the intersection. If that vehicle does not clear the intersection in that time frame, the signal simply continues its normal timing, minimizing disruption to everyday traffic. Vehicles can make priority control requests several ways, including infrared light emission, radio waves, or cellular communications. Infrared and radio systems use standalone hardware on a vehicle and at the intersection. A cellular-based solution can communicate over existing infrastructure using software and network-connected devices. Regardless of which system is deployed, Priority Control helps your city manage how vehicles move through its streets. To learn more, visit gtt.com or contact your local sales rep today.